Hey Realmwalkers, I am Sarah Desorbus, and I hope you're having a fantastic day today. And if not, come and chill out with us anyways. This is episode 14 of Stranded Among the Realms, which is an extreme difficulty playthrough of Nightingale. And today we are going to be checking out the Astrolabe Swamp. We're going to probably skim this and not do too much in here. We're probably not going to do the Fate Tower because we don't really need to. We just need to capture like a few POIs just to see what recipes we can get and then go straight to the essence trader to get the rest. And yeah, that's going to be that. Let's um let's get into it. So if you can see that's my little hut over there. Couldn't place it near the um the portal because as you can see it's kind of underwater and uh no one wants to sleep in water so that's where we're at also the fate tower is way over there like, way way over there like past that tower you can see it's just off of the distance in fact let's see if we can see it yeah you can see it kind of peeking out from behind there it is it is far <laughs> There's all this water between us. So what we're going to do is we're just going to make this circle all the way around until we hit the essence trader and see what we can unlock. Cool? Cool. Uh, this looks like a Bastille of Agility, which probably is going to have a lot of fighting in it. And um, do we need to spend, say, an hour trying to beat this Bastille of Agility just to get, what, like a hundred essence? Eh, I don't know. It might be worth it. But that's a lot of time. We could be doing a lot of other things in the meantime. Ooh, we need food. It looks kind of dark in there, doesn't it? There's critters in there. If stuff starts spawning, we leave. No? No one's gonna spawn? Oh, yep, someone spawned. So, yep, never mind. We just keep on going. There's no point to dealing with that. Like I said, there's we got better things to do today. We... Our true goal here is to go after the Provisioner card. And we want to equip ourselves and min-max ourselves as much as we can so that we can take on the Provisioner side of power. Because that's when we get better equipment. Huh? Oh. Hey, what the fuck? Let's make a little space for ourselves. Okay, that's... That's annoying. Dude. Oh shit. Oh, I got stuck on a tree. That's death number three. Well, we are starting out poorly. Ah, oh, man, that really sucked getting stuck in that tree. Also, that's used a lot. The durability on this axe got pretty screwed up. Was it already like half broken or something? Ugh, water. Alright, let's go get our shit. Ah, 
Excuse me. Oop, oop. So the creatures out here are level 80, and our gear is 45, 46. So yeah. Are they hanging around? Can we get our, our chest? Oops. All. Okay, we can't let ourselves get swarmed. Oh, it's empty. Of course it is. And we miss. I hate that they can spin around mid swing and hit you anyways. Like if their target was over there, they can still see what I mean. Oh shit. Fucking trees. Keep backing up into trees. Die. Get the fuck out of here. I can't believe we died to just a bunch of trash mobs, but oh well, that's the that's the price for getting stuck on trees. Oh well, can't do anything about it. Oh, oh man, that equivalent thing sucks. Like, just give me, just, you know what, instead of that all or equivalent or whatever that bullshit is, just give us a loot all button. Like, hit F, loot all. Like, giving us options there just makes things not so confusing, but it just bogs down gameplay. Swamp water sucks. Oh no. Hippo. Hippos are the worst. They are the worst. I want to kill it. Because the last thing I want to do is have it chasing us. Um, we could... We should. Head towards this Bastille of Agility. Oh wait, no. That's, that's this thing. We don't want to do that. I think that's a pink one and a gray, gray one. Either way, let's let's get out of here.
Can't wait, hippos. We didn't get a recipe. Let's do another site and see if we get another recipe. And if not, then we go... I guess we keep doing them until we reach the uh, essence trader. Okay, we got endurance, so let's do this. Oh. Okay, we must have gotten all the recipes. Look at soaring. Uh, east, southeast. up here. More ruins. People are really just crashing their airships to the ground, huh? They're just like, over there is good. Hippo. Ooh, look at that little grove. And this grove. Let's grab some stuff while we're here. Here to swamp fiber. Really? Do you have to follow me? This is just quite a sight. This really is a beautiful game. Hey guys. Let's just soak this in for a second. Oh man, there are food. got over here. Is this iron? No, this is nice. That's iron. Let's grab us some iron.
Ooh. What's this? Let's go take a look-see. Let's go take these things out now. Oh, it's horrible. That was weird. Okay, guys. Something weird with the uh, the clipping around this thing. Oh. oh, stuck there for a second. Ow, ow, that hurt. really not handling this area very well. We need a much better everything. We need a much better everything. Cool, we're running out of essence dust. We're going to need to farm up a bunch of essence dust. Give, give the cabbage. Sorry, not a cabbage. It's a water spinach. All right, let's go in here. Let's see what's going on. Ooh, take a little workshop. Are there any goodies? Nope. Why is there so much uh, hitching? Oh, it's okay. Those are um, they're not aggressive. Ooh, you see the hippo? Man, this, this place is not doing so hot. All right, moving on, let's go northwards. So I just realized I haven't been recording my webcam, but whatever, it doesn't even matter. So I just turned that back on. Hopefully it was okay. Looks like it's a um, agility place, and we need food. Why? Why so much? Really? Get up. Get up. Stand up. 
Stand up for your rights. Settler, I'm gonna settler card. Sure. Okay, that wasn't it. Uh, what? <laughs> oh, I wasn't running. What is going on? All right, and he's just north of us, so right over there. Ruben. What you got? Illumination? Okay. That'll help. Charms. I think we've got pretty much everything. Purifying potion. Rejuvi potion. Spring rolls. Ooh. Ink making sets. Okay. I think we've got pretty much everything we can get from from the astrolabe realms so let's let's just go back we don't really need anything out here so except for resources which we can just come back later and just get as we want um, i think we've got plenty of swamp fibers spinaches iron wood Home sweet home. Ooh, we got some plants to take care of. Let's do that later. Let's put away all our goods. rope. Who the hell had crude rope? You know what? Sure. Portobello mushroom paint. stuff put away let's um let's take a look at our gear let's make sure that we are actually uh geared up uh da -da 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 -da. oops that's not what i want to look at but actually yes i do let's see if there's any buildings we what why is there 94 of 94 new that's It's a bug. It's a bug. It's kind of annoying because I'd like to see what new thing I actually got. And my other my other character, it's not a problem. But this character, for whatever reason, the new always resets. Grr. Okay, so we can't look at it that way. Is there anything here we can see? Maybe augments that's new? Um, 
I don't think so. Okay, fine. Let's look at crafting. Is there anything in here that we need to add? Actually, wait. Let's look at our equipment because that's really the thing that's going to make or break our provisioner run, right? So we just made the hat. What we need to do is add... Oh, you know what? This has durability plus plus, but none of these do. So we're going to want to replace all of this. Now the weapons and stuff... Actually, not only are we going to want to replace this, but we're going to want to up them with charms and with... Charms and enhancements. Sorry, I had like a burp. I don't know. Like I... Sure. <laughs> Thanks, burp. Thanks for interrupting my sentence. Um, yeah, so we're going to need charms and essences or enchantments to put on here. We need to fill all these up. Well, once we make new stuff. And we need to do the same for these guys. For all our weapons. Um, we are going to need... A simple mall. Do we use a mall or do we use the pickaxe? I think we use the pickaxe to fight them. Is there anything else we in here we need? We could switch to this aristocratic stuff, the purple gear. Sorry, it's not purple gear. The um, the steam gear, or twitch gear. Man, my brain's just not connecting properly. Um, oops, let's put the rifle cartridges away. Now, I feel like this is cheap. We could use this for better everything. It's got better health, better damage but we shouldn't lean on that you know let's let's go with what the game game has given us naturally cool came back with a bunch of wood uh stored most of them away just gonna craft up a bit more bit more bit more paper and let's see we need to eat Although we probably shouldn't have eaten our good food, but whatever, we got tons and tons of it. Uh, we're going to need to make some injury cells. Essence, fervor, force, rage. I'll we'll probably want spell sword. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. What's bounty? Um, okay, yep, we'll need that. So eight, eight different things. Cool. We're gonna want some infusions as well. So probably max health and max stamina. We'll want stamina efficiency, we'll want encumbrance, speed. We could do stamina regen and health regen, but I think they take the same slots as max stamina and max health. So maybe we do... I think max is better for now, because this equipment's not very good. So just having more of the maximums would be great. Uh, we're going to want lots of critical damage. We're going to want range damage, maybe strength. Let's try doing a bunch of critical damages. Okay, first let's make the actual equipment, yeah? Alright, so figured out all of our 
what we're going to need. Okay, figured out what we're going to need, and that's 10 leather and 32 plant fiber. So let's go with 32 swamp fibers. Because these are going to give us 10% uh, max health, 10% max stamina. We're also going to need 10 leathers, which, which means 20 pelts. Let's do 12. Let's do 12 predator pelts and then 8 prey pelts. Let's make a bunch of leather. While that leather's being made, let's uh, do some gardening. Oh, I'll uh, we'll probably do this. We're gonna want some chamomile. Gonna be turning uh, chamomile into our spices. Nope, not Cape Aloe. Let's get some water going. that's done let's go take a look at our felt or our leather still being made it's gonna be a while huh in which case let's make some food yes put these away I also can't wait until I can make better food because that's going to be a game changer for us. Get that fire on so this goes a little bit faster. See if you inspect it, it's well lit, it's warm, and it cre decreases by 20 30 seconds. So that's kind of nice. Now, as far as tools go, I think we only need to, yeah, we only need to apply charms and stuff to them. So we're good there. Okay, time to get naked.
Down to our skivvies. Let's um get rid of all this. Why do I have a spare wood bundle? Alright, let's start making stuff. Uh, simple boots. We want this to be... Oh, you know what? Let's make predator stuff first. So that's going to be, what, gloves? Let's do shirt, breeches, and pack, and the rest can be prey. Sure. This looks good. Grab these guys. And we're going to want boots, capelet, and gloves. Ooh, this only gives health. Same with this one. So maybe we switch from swamp fibers. I think forest. Yeah, forest has maximum health. So let's do that. And it and it increases maximum weight. So that's good. So how much do we need? 14? Cool. Okay, boots. Ooh, this doesn't give us anything. Interest. Oh, because it's stealth rating. Okay, let's look at Capelet. You know, it gives us cold resistance. What about the gloves? Nothing either. So we need to switch to a different leather than Prey Pelt. I thought it would help, but it doesn't. So, let's put that away. I mean, if they do nothing, they do nothing. So, cannot be helped. So, Capelet, which gives us at least some cold resistance. Um, yeah. And then gloves are last, which would have been nice to get something, but oh well. Let's upgrade these things. I mean, we got plenty of enough essence, so... Two charms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're gonna want a charm on the axe and the pick as well. Maybe the sling bow. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten different charms. Uh, we were gonna do eight. One, two, three, 
four, five, six. Essence, I think, just every time we kill stuff, yeah. So after killing a few things, then the charm will manifest the nests. Not bad. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We could double up. We don't have to double up on anything. So, oh, it's a lot of rough bobble. Two, three. So they're all rough bobbles. So eight, eight of them. Oh, we need plant fibers. Is it one for one? Yep, one for one. Okay. Okay. Let's now look at what charms we need. Uh, charm ingredients. So charm twine mind. Um, Stuff like that. So I'm going to count that out. Give me a second. Okay, so Charm Twine Heart needs polished coral. And you might be asking, how do you, the fuck do you get coral? And that's actually pretty easy. You just need to go out to the ocean. Let's show you that. Let's show you that now. Nice little sunset. So go out until you can basically see these things. And those are all coral. Okay, we're running out of stamina, so let's go back. So that got us about 12 coral. And the way to polish it, I believe, is here. Yep, polished coral. And we need just one of them. The rest of the coral we can just put away. We don't need it right now. Let's uh, let's grab that. Okay, let's get these done. So we're gonna need two charm twine eyes. Just one of these, right? Now we need two of these. We're gonna need one charm twine heart. And two of these. Sorry, we need three of those. Make some charms. And it doesn't matter what you make, like what, what the base materials are, they won't ever add bonuses. Or if they do, I haven't seen it. It's probably something higher up. We, we I don't know. Okay, so bounty. Fervor next.
And last one, Charm of the Spell Sword. We're probably going to want a recovery on our pickaxe as well. Or, actually... Um, there's something we can do. Let's see, where's our augments? There's... Because we actually have... Yeah, we can do this Auburn's Bounty, but we need Formula Board. Okay, so let's build a Formula Board. Which we need sticks, cardstone, hide, paper. We'll put that... Oh boy, where do you put this? Gosh, there's no room. Okay, maybe we take a little table. Boop, form the board. Okay. Oh, why didn't we get... Why didn't Oberon's... Oh, there it is. Weak human seal. Okay, I guess we don't have any of those. Oh, we... How do we still have twine? Did I miscalculate the twine? Probably. Probably. I mean, obviously, yes. Um, what do we need? <laughs> totally forgot what we need. Weak human seal, T1, tier 1 essence. And what do we need for another recovery? So, two weak human seals. Gotcha. That needs stone block bones. So, two bones. I don't want to waste good bones. Oh wow, that's going to take a while. Okay, let's, let's actually, let's make some infusions. Uh, what did we say we needed? Range damage, that's for sure. Crit damage. Let's do let's do a malice infusion. This hurt or helps. This hurts. This hurts. Stam efficiency. I think this is per item. So let's not mess with that one. Right? I think this is for the item that we're using. Yeah, it's for... Or maybe not. Hmm, let's make it. How many do we have? One, two... That's a lot, actually. We might be full up. That's okay. So that's nine items. Yeah, we're, we're, we're good in that end. One of you. And one of you. 
Illumination is nice, but you plop it down on a specific spot, and that's not quite as useful as it should be. Like, if you could apply it to your weapon, that'd be great. Like, if you could put illumination on your own knife or whatever as you're going down, you know, some cave. Perfect. But as far as I can see, this is not very good. Okay, let's look at some pretty stuff while we... Actually, wait, let's do it this way. Bust and move. So we'll apply... Okay, so first let's try to put the recovery on the pickaxe. And Oberon's bounty more easily fell trees and shatter minerals with their next hits and maybe charge for multiple hits. We can put this on the knife. The knife or the sickle. Probably the sickle because we use that less, so we can put... Yeah, let's put it in the sickle. Let's not overthink it. Okay, now let's do... These. Let's do the max health first and max stamina because they're the most limited. They can only put them on shirts or pants. So. Oh, wait. You can put the health one on whatever you want, but. I think we put it in the pants, anyways. Everything else can go anywhere else. Let's see, encumbrance. Wait, is this the right one? Yeah, maximum weight, 5%. Let's apply that to our backpack. Perfect. Uh, blocking efficiency. Let's look at stamina efficiency. Ah, see? It's for the item. That's fine, we just don't use it. Uh, let's put... Put it on the axe. Or do we, just do, do we put damage on it? Ooh, we can put damage in our glove. That might be better. So let's do that there. Let's put range damage on the bow, because obviously. Uh, crit damage on... Oh, that sucks. Let's put on the axe. 2% though. Is that worth it? Because all, all that'll do is make our 1 times 1.5, like times 1.515 if that makes sense like it won't here let's let's actually let's do it yeah like it didn't even register but okay whatever stam efficiency yeah we can't we can't use that blocking efficiency let's put that on the the pickaxe Oh, we can't apply the resist on anything. Okay. So we're missing one. One, two. Three enchants or infusions. And probably what we can do here is damage. Can we apply damage? No. So... We can do range damage on this guy. 
on the hats. We can do health. So range damage on the hat, health on the capelet. Health on the boots. Or do we do regen? No, we can't do regen. Just health. Okay. Hopefully this works. Yeah, so we put it on capelets. And boots. Range damage on the hats. Cool. Okay, so we should now be pretty kitted out. 47, yeah. Okay, let's add these charms. First, let's put these away so we don't get confuzzled. Thing is, where can we apply? Are there any that are limited? It looks like we can apply whatever we want to whatever we want. That's kind of nice. Okay, so let's. Oh, do we need to make a better umbrella? Nah. Okay, spell sword, sniper, fencer, rage. Force, fervor, essence. Let's do sniper first. Let's put down our hat. Spell sword, let's add it to our shirt. Uh, let's see. Fencer can go on our gloves, I guess. Rage. Uh, capelet? Sure. Let's see, the essence can go in the backpack. Okay, and that leaves us pants, boots, Um, this can go pants. Cool. That should be everything, right? Okay. Charm of Bounty. We can put this... See, this is specifically for plant life, but I don't think it does too, too much. So let's just put this on... Wait. Does this have a charm already? No. We can put that, yeah, on the... Umbrella. Okay, and we are pretty kitted up. We're at the absolute best we can go at 47. But that's still kind of a scary thing. The provisioner... Provisioner's going to be tough. Um, it's going to be quite a challenge for us. But I think I'm gonna. Oh, oh. Also, I made a quick update. I 
I changed this around so there's three of them instead of just two. Uh, reason being is then we can have, you know, forest, desert, swamp, and any whatever we want, plus one more for anything we need. So yeah, figured that was necessary. Um, just so we have some more flexibility. Ooh, we're starving. In uh, in our basically more more flexibility in what portals we can use. Okay, let's go. Let's go have ourselves a snack. Snacky room. Oops. Okay, calm down. I know you're hungry, but um, chill, friend. Chill. Why is there s why is it fucking hitching so much? <laughs> Fuck you game. Fuck you OBX. OBS. Just work. Cool? Cool, cool, cool. Where is the provisioner? Oh my god, provisioner side of power is all the way there. It's gonna be a trek. It's gonna be quite a trek. So if the provisioner side of power is all the way on the north side, I think a good idea is to make a fairy ring. So if we die, we don't have to make this freaking hike all the way back north. So we should bring equipment for a a tent, you know, a place to respawn. So let's do that. Okay, we need synchronous wood bundle, stone blocks, so one, four, four. getting ready to make that for tomorrow all right gonna call it for now uh we got a bunch of stuff done uh it wasn't super exciting you know we, we went through the uh, astrolabe swamp and just kind of gathered up what we could which was not very much at all and we came back and did some upgrades which and that's going to prepare us for the uh the provisioner side of power which it, it's going to be so hard for us because it's going to be what level 80 you know, we only have level 47 gear. But we need to do it because it's, there's some better gear out there in Provisioner. And that leads us one step closer to Herbarium, which is going to have the NTC, NTTC gear. That's going to be a good come up. But yeah, for now, this is what we got. Hope you all enjoyed and I'll uh, catch you all next time. All right. Peace.